Let's count down the top 5 boys at Cataplum. Number 5 out from Poe. Whether you like visiting Cataplum for its safe fields or sort of a Mexico City upon a video, or the fun of watching the dreaded junkies' faces as you sit by on the nearest bench, sometimes nothing beats getting dizzier than you've ever gotten before upon a Zampella Disco. And whilst it is definitely the biggest version of these rides, for the exact same reason, it is also one of the craziest, with in a nutshell a smaller 20 or so person disc, which FYI has got some of the most uncomfortable spine crushing restraints on the planet, spinning and rocking significantly more along a U-shaped track than your normal version. Number 4 Nanas Nevertheless, if you are still not going to rush to the nearest restroom dizzy yet, then feast your eyes upon Nara's air show, which as you can probably guess by the name, you are just about to take part in. And oh yeah, it is not going to be easy either, with from the moment you and out of one other pilot climb aboard one of these open airplanes, till you get the rush to the nearest restroom kind of dizzy, you will both be spun rotated but worst of all, pause upside down again and again and again. So what are you not waiting for? Put on those brave faces, it is now time to depart on your tree one of a kind of flight. Number 3 Patas You can not have a theme park without a pendulum ride, but not all pendulum rides go completely upside down. And so in here, not like all the other rides we have covered so far, this one too is small, and for the exact same reason, even crazier than your average version of these rides, there was no question that this is top 3 worthy. Saying that though, it is only when you are actually upon the disc, feeling out wind rushing sensation against your faces, whilst you rotate slash spin completely upside down many, many times, that you rise the full force of a patus, which for all of my non-Mexican speakers out there is crazy enough, means dizzy spell. Number 2 Chaos Locos Okay, you and your star are most likely grateful for our next attraction is not going to leave you totally dizzy, or will it, as from first sight that Karos Locos may look like your normal wild mass coaster, featuring many sharp twists, turns, drops, and I must say some incredible views across Mexico City and the surrounding mountain range. Nevertheless, normally when it is too late, you realise that in addition to all of this fun, the specially designed car that, yes, you will also be sat in, will in fact be freely spun around the majority of this, Thus, it is probably the best to soak in those incredible views whilst you get a chance. Number 1 in Mizio. Now, I've got to admit, the per family coast above all of these thrill rides does seem a little bit weird to me, but as you can most likely see when you make it off the top of that lift hill and it feels like you are dangling miles off the ground, the family fun aspects quickly turn into something totally insane. Therefore, instead of discussing even more about the not many family elements and those bone chilling other ones, I am going to leave you with one final tip, which would be to rise such iconic rise earlier on, as amongst them building up some extremely long queues and being even more unique, you do not want them to break down at all. Thank you all for watching, bye bye.